Hey guys, in this video I will show you how to use Auto DS with Shopify. All right, so let's begin with the video. So I'll go over the entire step-by-step -step process from beginning to end, from creating your Auto DS account. Then I'll show you how you can add it to your Shopify store, so how you can connect it to. Then I'll show you how you can search products on the Auto DS marketplace or import products even in bulk from suppliers such as AliExpress and Amazon. And then I'll show you how you can import those products onto your Shopify store and how the order fulfillment works when using AutoDS. And I'll go over all of their other automation features in this video. So, starting off with creating our AutoDS account. So go to official website of AutoDS. Once here, click on Get Started, and it will take you to this page. So I'll just sign up with Google, but you can also enter these details right here. So after you fill in those details here, it will say, I want to sell on. Now from this list, just going to pick Shopify, since we are going to be selling on Shopify. So then click continue. And now here, they have a few different packages. Now you can either pay annually or monthly. I'll just set it to monthly. And then you can see they have import 200, starter 500, advanced 1K, and some more premium packages right here. But I think the price and stock monitoring feature is really important. So therefore, I will go with Starter 500. But you can pick any package that you would like to use. You can see what exactly it's for. So this is the most basic automation features. This is a full-scale drop shipping automation solution, perfect for beginners creating a store, which is the one that I will pick. And this is for experienced drop shippers who need more products and faster support. So click on any of them. Then here, enter your payment details, and after you enter your details, just click on Continue. So after doing that, you will see this, go and close this, and then you will see this screen. So before doing this, make sure that you already have a Shopify store. If you don't have an account yet, it's really easy to create one. You don't even need to add any credit card details or anything like that. Signing up will only take one or two minutes. So after doing that, just go back to AutoDS. And now here, click I have a Shopify store connected to AutoDS and then click continue. So then if you already have a tab open where you are signed into your Shopify account, you will see install right here, but otherwise it will say sign in. So I'll just click on install and then confirm by clicking on install again. So now we have already connected our store. Then just going to close this and now we can actually start using AutoDS and we can get into the fun stuff. So first here in the overview, you have a marketplace. They have print on demand. You see your dashboard, which is basically your analytics and they have your orders here. You can see the products, your drafts, and you can contact customer support. Now, what I want to go into first is the marketplace where they already have a bunch of products. So what I really like to do is go to ships from right here and then just select the area that you would like to sell in. For example, if I select United States and I want to also sell in the United States, you can see this product here has a shipping time of one to five business days. This one has 19 business days, two to five business days. So this way, you can find products that ship really, really fast. Then next, I would filter by a category and create your Shopify store within one category because that way you have kind of a branded store. So for example, you could do home improvement and tools or outdoors, sports and fitness, pets, or any of these other ones. For this example, I will go with pets. Now you could even do one of these subcategories such as dogs, cats, fish, or any other category that it may show here. Now what I'm going to do is set it to best sellers right here. So you will see that this dog bed right here is a best seller. So if we click on it, you will then see this product. So they have different colors of this product and you can see these images look really good and you can simply import this onto your store. Now first, I'll show you how you can import a product from the AutoDS Marketplace. And then after that, I'll show you how you can import AliExpress, Amazon, or many other suppliers' products onto your Shopify store, all within a few clicks. Now you will see this specific product shipping price to the United States. 
it's free. Shipping and processing time is one business day, and it has 5,809 reviews with 4.6 out of 5, which is really good. So, all you need to do is click on Import Draft right here, and then what will happen is that it will show up here in your drafts. So click on Drafts, and now here you will see the small dog car seat cover, etc. Now what I recommend you to do is click on the drop-down, and then here click on Optimize Title with AI, and then I will do Title and Description. For example, you could make it sound more professional, sellable, funny, or optimized for social networks. I will say sellable, and then for the description, I will also say sellable. Now here, you can choose a temperature, balanced, more creative, or precise. I'll say balanced and click AI Write. Now when you create your account, you will get 30 free AI credits. So after it's done, just go and click on Save. It may look a little bit weird right here, but once it's on your Shopify store, it will look good. So click Save right there. And then what you can do is click on Import, and now it is being imported onto your Shopify store. So I'll show you that on the store in a minute. First, what I want to do is click Add Products here, and then you can choose Single Products. So import one product to one store. Multiple products or stores import multiple products together. You can get the hand-picked products or use the AutoDS Finder untracked products. But what I'm going to do is click Single Products. Now here, what you can do is choose a supplier source. So they have all of these that you see right here. Now if you paste in a link, then it will recognize the supplier automatically, so you don't have to enter that. So first, I'll just add an Amazon product. So staying in the dog category, I will just get one of these dog food dispensers. So I want to get one that is not branded, for example, this one right here. So once you have found that product, just copy the product link, go to AutoDS, and paste in that URL right here. And then you will see supplier source gets set to Amazon automatically and the region, the United States. So now you can immediately publish it to your store or you can quickly edit it, which is what I recommend, so that you can actually, again, optimize the title and description with AI. So click AI Write. And this is really easy. And I love this feature from AutoDS because this just saves me a bunch of time. So then click Save. Now here in the product section, what you can do is under monitoring, you can set up stock and price monitoring. Now I recommend turning this on for every single product that you upload onto your store because this is one of my favorite AutoDS features. Now on the question mark, you can see exactly what it does if you're interested. So just go and click on save and import. And then this one will also be imported onto your store. Then of course, you can also go and edit the price, but they will have an automatic price optimization right here, which is what I personally like to use. So you will see the buy price right here, and then the sell price is here. So that leaves you with this profit margin. And then the same for the other product here that we had from the marketplace. It also creates a markup automatically. So I like to just keep this pricing. Now finally, if you want to add an AliExpress product, and of course you can also do this with any other supplier, but if I would like to do AliExpress, then first, in the top right, select the area that you want to sell in. So here I'm going to pick the United States and click Save. So now I will just find a product that I would like to sell from AliExpress. For example, if I would like to use this product right here, then I can just copy the link to this product, go back into AutoDS, click Add Products again, Single Product, and paste in this URL. And again, I recommend clicking Edit Now. Then here, you can even pick the shipping method that you would like to use. For example, cheapest, cheapest with tracking, or the fastest with tracking. Now again, I will turn on Stock and Price Monitoring. Then here, you again can edit the product description. You can also create a template if you want, and you have your variants, and this all gets imported onto your Shopify store correctly automatically, which is really important. And now what you can do is again click Save and Import. So now I will get into how it actually looks on your Shopify store and how the order fulfillment works. So of course, adding them to your store and getting sales is one thing, but you need to actually fulfill those orders. 
So I'm going to open up my Shopify store here. And now you will see we have already completed Add Your First Product. So if you head into the product section here, you will then see all three products that I have added so far. Now, if you hover over one of these with your mouse and click on the preview icon right here, you will then see what it looked like. So again, the price has been marked up to this and the title has been imported. So have the images right here along with the description. Now, what I recommend you to do first before actually building out your store is to go and click on online store right here. And first, just go and pick a theme that you like. So click on any theme right here. So you can just get a free theme and the basic theme is not my favorite. So you can just click all themes right here and then click free themes. Then here you have a bunch of themes that you can use completely for free. Now one that I personally like is this one, trade. So I'll open up the trade theme here and then click try theme. And now it will be adding trade to your online store themes. So then it will open up this page and now under theme library, we will now have the trade theme right here. And now click on publish. Then confirm by clicking on publish again. So now when you view your store, we will now see our store right here. So of course we wanna go and customize all of this. But if we head into the catalog right now under products, you will see all the products that we have added so far. So for example, if we click on this product, you will then see what it looks like. You will have the images and all of the variants will be imported automatically. Now I do recommend customizing your store to make everything look better, but you can see you have the variants here along with the prices and people can just choose what they want and then they can go and purchase it. Now you also need to go into your Shopify store, then go to settings. Then here for the payments, I recommend to use Shopify payments because that offers a wide range of payment methods for your customers. Now, you can also add different payment methods right here. So just go and customize your store, add in all the products that you want, and then what will happen? Once you start marketing your store, you will get some orders. And then here in the order section on AutoDS, you will see all of the orders that you have. So, you have auto order credits, which basically means that orders will be getting fulfilled automatically by AutoDS. So you can click buy credits if you need more, but you already get five when creating your account. So five credits will have five orders fulfilled for you automatically. So that means that you will already be making money and then you can buy more if you want for as low as 20 cents per credit. Now you can of course also try out the print on demand so you can simply edit the product and then also import it onto your store. But I have not used this yet, so I don't know if it is good. But in terms of the marketplace and the importing products and the automation features that are included in AutoDS, I really like those and I definitely recommend you to use AutoDS. It's my favorite dropshipping tool. Now here in the dashboard, which is the final thing that I will go over, you can see how many orders you've gotten, your profit, your total revenue, the new products that you have added, etc. So go and create your Shopify and AutoDS accounts. Just follow every single step that I showed you in this video. And I recommend adding lots of products to your store and just having, for example, a pet store or some kind of a sports and outdoor store. Just have one specific niche that you are selling products in. That way you can market your store really well to a specific audience. And that's it. So that's basically how you can use AutoDS with Shopify. So that's all for this video. Consider subscribing if you find it helpful, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.